Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to OPTV Live's Mech Mania Monday. Tonight for you, we have a special treat. It is Grudge Wars. That is right, ladies and gentlemen, Grudge Wars. These two players right here have been talking trash to each other for, uh, for a while now, and we've decided to give them an avenue to settle their score right here live on the stream. We've got Drac Connor over on the left-hand side flying that steampunk Osprey. His opponent, Zoe Chan, slash Gam Gam, slash Gammy, slash Bagel, slash Only Bagel, slash whatever my name is, is his opponent. She is sporting that brand new Pax Helix. So for those of you that have been wondering what that Pax Helix looks like, there you go, guys, right there. That is the new Helix. Check it out. Not only is she flying with the Helix, but she's got three of her brand new bagel pets that were designed for her, courtesy of Carbon Games. That really says a lot when a game company will actually manufacture and add something into the game for you uh, just for being a player and a supporter of the game. So that, that's pretty OP right there. But anyway, right now, taking a look, we've got Dracona. He is approaching for the bottom lane. A little bit harder, granted, to get through. Uh, as you've got two outposts of defenses to get through, but that is his approach. However, uh, Gam Gam slash Zoe Chan over here is just setting up a lot of defenses, making sure that that outpost is not going to be cheesed. She's got a bunch of sentry turrets and honeypots. This thing is uh, turning into a bit of a Fort Knox right here. Uh, not quite sure exactly what her plan is. Uh, interestingly enough, I just realized looking up at her loadout, uh, she has a completely derp loadout here. She only took money makers, honey pots, sentry turrets, and those radar guardians. So she is at a uh, at a definite disadvantage in this match, as she has absolutely no offensive units, really no defensive units, no anti mech units. Um, if she can come out on top of this grudge match, I'll be incredibly, incredibly surprised. Um, I mean, to the point that I might have to actually just buy an extra bagel just for her. Um, Draft Connor, on the other hand, right here, as you can see, he's got a full loadout. He's got his bombs, his money makers, his uh, mortars, his patchers, his jammers, his uh, Geminis, his seekers, his uh, archies, and uh, some energy guardians. So he has a pretty much full loadout. Uh, which is why I'm really saying that Gam Gam is at a major disadvantage in this match and I'm not really entirely sure what she was thinking. Uh, taking a look at the upgrades right now, Dracana has got two levels of the heal and one level of a cargo carry. Meanwhile, Gam Gam slash Zoe Chan over here has got one level of rockets, one level of creeps, and one level of XP boost. What her strategy and her plan is, folks, I do not know. Um, in all seriousness, your guess is as good as mine. Um, I honestly, uh, I hate to kind of just say things against people, but unless these sentry turrets got a, she has some sort of special version of these sentry turrets that were given just to her, like some sort of ultimate sentry turret. Um, I just really don't see uh, how she's gonna be able to come out on this one. Uh, meanwhile, Jackana has essentially completely taken the bottom lane. Uh, they're asking something about, does this count? Yes, this does count, guys. This is your match. This is the tournament. Uh, Jackana worried about the wrong loadout. Uh, Jack, I mean, obviously you don't know right now because you can't see, but you have nothing to worry about. Uh, with your loadout, uh, Gam Gam has nothing besides her helix. Um, and the sentry turret instantly goes down. Honey Pot doesn't stand much of a chance. Gam Gam using those rockets, but that heal ability of the Osprey is too much for for the rockets and she cannot even do any damage onto those tanks and she's now just trying to take Drac Connor out. But Drac Connor is all the way up at a level five. Two levels of heal, two levels of carry ability. Gam Gam at level two only with only being able to build those sentry turrets just cannot have enough damage to even take out an Osprey. Um, there's not really much I can say about this folks. Um, Definitely surprised me. I, I 
I, yeah, I really expected, uh, I, I expected Gam Gam to come out to really put Jack Connor in his place with the fact of all the yellow submarine jokes that Jack Connor was saying. Um, but it looks like that Jack Connor pretty much is having a little bit of a free for all right here. Uh, <laughs> Steve must be laughing at you. Um, Let's say yes and no all at the same time. Uh, there it is, folks. That is the game. Um, Draft Connor does win that game and will move on to the semifinals. Gam Gam was, uh, was very interesting to see you play. Uh, I'm not really quite sure what your strategy was, but either way, um, yeah, we'll say it's interesting. So anyway, that was game A of Mechmania Monday's Grudge Wars, hosted by Steve, broadcasted on OPTV Live. Stay tuned for game B.